Welcome to the channel everyone, Infinity Boss Auto is here and you're watching this video because you want to know how much does my bill cost me alright so we did a breakdown of majority of the stuff I miss a few stuff but trust me it's crazy I got a book here <laughs> alright so we're gonna just jump into it right away quick and fast and you have a calculator everybody take out on the calculator take out on the calculator alright yeah man we have a, we have a, we have a wicked and wild alright so the first thing is a turbo all right the turbo here cost me literally 500,000 that combined with the, the, the turbo grease yeah man um it's an air cool turbo 1100 horsepower 6767 1.0 rr right yeah man so the turbo they get it out 500 so we had 500 500 k all right we are move on that are the clearance and everything we move on to the turbo welds all right um the weld uh that's for labor work that in charge me 92,000 to just weld all the bends and make the kit for me right so 92,000 add on to that so we had 592,000 all right so we had the fuel pump the fuel pump is the 535 Elkiat I bought it a genuine one online no lie I buy one online and sell it back cheap in Jamaica because I want to use something different and realize I mean me need it I'm a run guy TJ everybody know TJ go buy one and that cost was 33,000 so plus 33,000 all right, so we had 625,000. The waste gates, I buy one brand new and I buy one used, right? So the brand new one was $80,000 and the used one was basically $35,000, all right? Um, so we're gonna add uh, the 80K, the $80,000 plus the $35,000. So we're at 740,000, all right? The search tank, y'all know me in a search tank, that cost me $28,000. So we're gonna plus that $28,000. All right, all right. So the may I basically add this because it's a part of the spending. The new wrap cost me one hundred and fourteen thousand. So we're gonna add that one hundred and fourteen thousand. All right. Plus it's gonna cost me another one hundred and ten thousand to get it wrap. So we add the one hundred and ten thousand into the tree. So we have nine hundred and ninety-two thousand. All right. So the exhaust now, the piping from the turbo go back to the car. It's a three inch. Go back to a two inch double pipe that cost me approximately where is it where is it fifty six thousand so we're gonna add fifty six thousand so we have to go whoa 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 we may have... sorry about that they may end up press the multiply <laughs> so we're back at the fifty six thousand upon the nine hundred and ninety two all right so we had the fifty six thousand all right so we had one million and forty eight thousand right so that's exhaust so now we are at, I buy some 18 inch rims. We did buy them rims away, sip on the car right now. When I drive up and down with, plus the VR30 transmission, upgraded transmission. Um, both of them, they come to 62,000 times two each. So 62,000 for each of them. So um, that'd be 124. So we are plus the 124. 124. Oh crap. Wait, may I pause again? Sorry about that again. I don't know why my hand keep touching that damn multiply button. <laughs> All right, so at the 124,000 plus they, they cost me, you know, the US, the guys them to go pick it up, it cost me 21,000. So they charge me 21,000 to go pick that up. So we're at 1.193 million, right? Um, the LSD cost me 59,000. That little LSD from Concept Z, yeah, 59,000. So we're gonna plus that again, and we're gonna put. 59,000 and it cost me 6,000 for clear that when you reach a Jamaica. All right, so we add the $6,000 upon that. All right, so we at 1.258 million. The differential bushings, come do all of the diff bushings for my car, it cost me 15,500. So we add the 15,500. Bam, we at 1.27, 1. 1. 1. yeah, 1,273,000. That's where we at now. All right, so we'll move on to a little bit of the interior, which is the Tesla screen. That cost me 400 US, but can we get it on a deal? Uh, sorry, 450. I got it on a deal from a friend. All right, brand new for a Tesla screen is 180,000. I'm going to get that chop straight down because the dog will literally give me. You see me? So I'm get that for um, 70,000. 70,000. So we had um, 1, 1, 1,273,000. Um, I know we have a plus 70 grand. 70. Alright, plus it cost me eight grand for clear that, so I'm gonna put that point in two, two, three, 
So we're at 1.3 million and 51,000. The interior light is cheap, but may add it. So um, it cost me three grand feet online or 6K to install it. So that's nine grand. So I don't have nine grand there. The seat cover them, I buy them from Burt's, big up on yourself. Um, it cost me 20K, that blue seat wrap. Yeah, man, they cover them. Yeah. So we have to add that, it cost me, don't it? Yeah, man. Probably it was a little five grand or some would add it. They, I bought some um, N555R tire for my friend and uh, it cost me 90,000 Jamaican dollars. So no plus that, 90,000 Jamaican dollar. We're at 1.4 million. Going down, um, the guy that rocked my car, TL, big up yourself, you know, go and do your thing, I love your work. Um, the labor cost was $82,000, and that's my price. You give me a very huge discount because I got the wrap sponsor, I can't put the wrap price on it, right? So we're going to add that $82,000. So we're at $1.5 million. The blower valve, Bebo, Bebo distributor, uh, distribution, yeah, distribution. Yeah, um, he sold me the blower valve for 10 grand, that was a 50 millimeter. You know, my price that again, yeah, balling down, love ball to Bebo, you know. So $10,000. All right, we're going down. The mirror covers them were custom made by this guy named Fiberglass, something like that. Probably we'll talk about the name or so. Yeah, he charged me 15 grand to do that cover, mirror covers. So we're going to plus that 15 grand. All right, we're going down again. The body work, the first time before they advertised the guy on the TikTok, there was a guy that did the body work before. And you know, um, it was okay, but I, I wanted more. So he charged me 12K to do that. And this new guy that I um, bring on the media and say, yo, this guy did the car, he charged me another 12,000. So that cost me 24,000 for complete body work. So that was 24,000. All right, we're going down here at 1.6 million flat. All right, so the BMW fan, I converted a BMW flat on, on, on my car. It was a 535 high. One of them, they, that, that car looked like a SUV, like I think it's a hatch. Yeah, I, I'm not good with the BMWs then, but it was a 535 high. Look like a SUV, the big type one. Um, 25,000 that guy sold me the fan for. It was selling for 30 and a ball him down. Yeah, I'm going to have a ball. So 25 grand. And now the rotors, my rotors, the big drill and slot them. The front rotors cost me 21,000. I don't put clearance in that cause those stuff were like it, it heavy like a lead so that's no clearance cost it's just a cost weight so 21,000 the aisle cooler cost me 23,000 add that the methanol kit I have a met kit on the car right now it cost me a hundred thousand big up yourself tuna nerd yeah do a good job you I love that methanol kit all right so that cost me a hundred thousand so we add another hundred thousand to this Okay, moving down, the race gas. I still have that race gas, guys. It cost me 19000 but I got to put it because it cost me <laughs> 19000 Wow. We well, I skip page. Oh, my goodness. The transmission aisle, I got to add that. I bought 10 buckler aisle. It cost 2200 for one of the arms I have. I have to add it because how much it cost me. It cost me $22,000 for 10 buckler aisle. I can't put that there, brother. The nitrous kit, I bought this from Bebo, right? The bottle was $18,000, right? The solenoid was $15,000. The buckle warmer was $8,000. The nitrous line, one pop from me. I made up to buy another one again, so I had two of them. I'm selling them uh, 9000 9000 9, 9, 10 yeah, $9,000. So 9 times 9 is 18. So $18,000. Because I tore them a buy. Right? And them charge me 3 grand to install it. Yeah. Maybe I should have put that, but I put it. The drug pack. I have a drug pack with a 15 inch with Mickey Thompson's on it. Cost me $400. US yeah, man. I got that use. So you know, me have a ball in the dark. I must sell it higher than that. I have a ball in them. So that is $62,000. See, I had $62,000 on that. So much ball on get, so much shish for my day. So tell me for my day. I buy a front bumper, which I thought was a sport bumper, but uh, when I ordered that bumper, it was 200 US. But the, 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 the guy who sell me the bumper tell me it's a sport one. And it looks a thrill, but when the bumper reach a Jamaica, I realize it's for the coupe. I don't have a coupe, I have a sedan. And it's like a waste of money. And it cost me $31,000. So I'm going to add that $31,000. Right? It cost me money. The dapper lights. The lights, you see me have dapper custom, 30 grand. I love that light dapper. 
love it the clear lens i buy some clear cover lens I have some clear cover you know to make it more better the the thing that the lights you know me attack the, the, the basically lens from the lens you know that cost me 26,500 26,500 we are two million dollar <laughs> i wouldn't have done yet the brake lines i upgraded my brake lines and it cost me 16,700 16,700 okay um the brake hold on there you know i pause you know oh caliper yeah caliper brake caliper so the brake caliper cost me thirty thousand dollars thirty thousand dollars this is crazy bro I'm, I'm shocked the gtr regulator them the gtr regulator not them sorry when i was the time when i went to was supposed to go to vernon and um, them fill up on the dyno yeah those cost me twenty six thousand dollars twenty six grand unbelievably failed and i'm the buy a cheap one which is ten thousand dollars so i'm gonna add that 10k moving on now three windshields i replaced out of my pocket that's nothing but my car i never insure for three time yeah man <laughs> one hundred and forty seven thousand cost me one hundred and forty seven thousand right away me have to go put on insurance for the car come here say that can't happen again and guess what it crack again and guess what half of it alone it provides for so it's going to cost me 20 or 1000 regardless but I'm not put that panic. I'm going to spend it you can not sort out wiring drum on the car 20 grand my dashboard I did wrap over the whole dashboard it cost me $40,000 uh, don't ask me where I don't remember exactly where the place is but if I drive I can't find it yeah I can't tell you the road the name but I can't find it though if I drive go alright the tuning now it costs 140,900 US. Plus 140,000. All right. Flex fuel kit. Um, and I did buy a fuel pressure kit. You understand? It is a combination. Um, Turkov. Um, it costs me 85,500. So we're gonna plus that with 85,500. Okay. Dino sessions cost me 25,000. I think that was at the countryside at Clarendon, and I spent about 12 grand at the Dino Dunrobin. So, we have the 25,000, and plus that would be 12,000. All right. And the paddy shift, my car didn't come with paddy shift because it's the base version sedan, so I bought paddy shift, and it cost me 29,000 for paddy shift. Unbelievable how expensive it is. So, it's 29,000. All right, we're almost done. So there's a thing called a, called a desk key and architect for my car and the dongle where we can tune the car with. So I have to buy that and it cost me 56200 So 56200 And I destroyed three front lips on my car. I'm going to buy one more, make it four for put it down when the car don't wrap. Right? That's $40,000 it cost me plus 40k. All right, and final but not least, um, the front grills. That I, well, this tried now. Um, it cost me 10k plus 10,000. So, guys, unbelievable. This car cost me 2.7 million and 10,400 dollars in modifications that I want this car to look like and drive like, sound like, feel like. That's what it cost me 2.7 million dollar. How much I bought this car for? It was what, two years ago or two and a half years ago? I bought this car. Something between there. I think it was in the January. I bought the car for 1.5 million. The guy was selling it for 1.8 million. And I bought it for 1.5 million dollar in a cash. See? And fast forward, I spent 2.7 million on the car in modifications. And, and I'm not done yet. I got rods to buy, head gasket, um, head studs. Um, I have, I want to sleeve the block. No, I removed that. So we stay, stay at the head studs. Um, flex plate. I want to buy a um, one piece drive shaft, so I have five more things to buy on this car. You understand? Because I'm going to build the engine. So we're going to go up to three point add million. Folks, building a car, trust me. I could not afford it if I, if I was running a business. I'm telling you guys, it's a sport. If you don't love it, don't, don't do it. Please, do not do it. It is obvious spend. Just a spend and a spend and a spend. I've done $2.7 million spending in the space of one year basically me a boost a car literally one year you understand literally one year guys 
is it's, it's a re it's a rich man's sports. I agree with the guy that tell me that. <laughs> it's a rich man's sports, honestly. Look how much money I spend and the car run 12-3 and I crash. Hmm? The car have a lot more in it in the folks. Don't get it wrong here because when I crash, the car was on low boost. So if I never crash, I'll just go back, turn up the power, run back a better time. Look how I run again, just revise, go back again. So, I mean, the car is, is okay. It's just some body works. And I get back for it again. But I'm telling you guys, this sport is stupid expensive. If you do a 95, you got to breed you. Yeah, you got to breed you, brother. Trust me. And if you do a business, you got to slow down your business. Literally. You understand? Trust me, bro. It's, it's, it's not nice. But the love of my half feet, I don't think I'm going to ever stop. I don't think I'm going to ever stop. The only way it can really stop is I get less power hungry. Because the more power hungry I be, is the more money I spend. Like, for example, what if 500 horsepower was my goal? I wouldn't have to be building the engine. I would just stop right here. I don't want more power. You understand? The only thing spending can come in is that buying gas or if I damage anything on the vehicle while I'm doing poles or whatsoever. But the more power you want, I am building this engine because I want reliability but I want more power. So you have to build the engine for faith to support all that power you give into the car. You understand? So trust me guys, the more power hungry you be, yeah, that costs you a lot of money. So this is what I spent on the car, 2.7 million. Yeah man. Like, share and subscribe. More video coming up. The next one is going to be the bodywork on the car and the wrap. So look out guys.